there can't be any suggestions at all that this was ever intended to be uh, free travel or that it was free travel. It wasn't. Uh, there was obviously a charge carried in the system within the business against that travel, uh, a charge that I uh, assumed had been processed against my credit card, but it turns out it hadn't. With whom did you speak? Uh, with uh, Mr Burns. You spoke with Mr Burns, yep. director. So he's the managing director, isn't that correct? Yeah, that's right. Of an ASX listed company, and he took your travel booking. Well, I, I made arrangements through him. It's to a make 717 well, market, market capitalised company, and he took your travel booking. I, I can only tell you uh, what happened. I made a booking through uh, Hello World, uh, engaging with Mr. Burns, that is right. Uh, and uh, I provided my credit card details and I, um, I, um, in, I asked for payment to be made and I was assured that this would, this would happen. But it's not just through Hello World, sorry. You don't just ring one of their employees, you ring the boss. Is that how it works? Well, I mean, he, he was my contact that I knew at Hello World and I made travel arrangements through him, that's right. It's an and, odd and arrangement. Through his office. Sorry? It's an odd arrangement. How did this arrangement come about between yourself and Mr Benz? Did he offer to facilitate your travel? Or did you approach him about becoming your travel agent? <laughs> Well, Hello World is a travel business and... They uh, are, but they I've don't advertise the CEO's phone number broadly for general public use. So I'm wondering about the circumstances that see you phoning the CEO of an organisation. The, the circumstance is that I organised the travel and uh, I booked travel and I paid for it. How, did, how do you know Mr Burns? Uh, well, I've known him over the years, obviously. I mean, it's a matter of public record that he uh, has been involved in the Liberal Party for some time.